In this video, we're going to look at where you can get free open source intelligence courses. Now, OSINT is a very much growing and popular field, so the best way to adapt is to learn, especially if you're new to the area. Every course that we go through will be linked in the description below, so all you need to do is head down there after the video. The first course we'll be going through is by Security Blue Team. They've been gaining a lot of popularity recently, and if you're not familiar with who they are, they basically provide high quality defensive cybersecurity training, certifications, and even community events. So once you head to the link in the description, you'll be on this website. You can see they have a number of different sections ranging from certifications, free courses, corporate training, and just some support. They also offer some great certifications like Blue Team Level 1 and Blue Team Level 2. So feel free to take a browse. They also have a cybersecurity careers page if you're interested, but obviously we're interested in the OSINT course. So once you head to free courses, you can see a number of them. We'll just need to click into open source intelligence. You can see that the course is listed as free and all you need to do is click the button to enroll onto the course. Looking at what's involved in the course, you have a number of practical challenges ranging from Harvester, TweetDeck, Google Docs, looking at OSINT frameworks, some really good stuff. And then you'll also be given a certificate of completion once you're done. This can easily be added to a CV or LinkedIn if you're interested. Looking more deeper into the course, you can see you've got some introduction topics, you've got intelligence, securing yourself online. You'll also be able to dive into different types of tools like TweetDeck and Google Docs. You can see you have topics as well as quizzes to test your learning. That's always the best way to do it. And then you have a final course challenge. So this is really good if you're a beginner in the OSINT area. I recommend you check that out. The second course that we have for OSINT is by Basel Institute on Governance. And if you've not heard of them before, they're basically an international non-profit organization that's dedicated to preventing financial crimes. So exactly what you'd expect to see when looking for resources for learning. Once you click the link, you'll be directed to this section on open source intelligence. You can see exactly what's involved in the course. You can see it has an introduction to OSINT, preparing your research environment, exploiting the visual and meta information of images and preparing reports. So right from the start all the way to the end, and it's developed by complete experts who are from ICAR and Green Corruption Program. So it's not something that just anyone's created. All you need to do is jump into the Enroll Me and you can then see all the different sessions laid out for you, which you can easily click into. Looking at the course itself, it's around five hours to complete, so not too short and not too long. And it has over three modules and nine sessions. So very good for a beginner who's looking at the OSINT or someone who's already in the field. Looking at each individual session, you can see they're covering social media, imaging information, reporting, exactly what I just mentioned previously. And you can also dive through the resources if it needs be. But just as an example, let's dive into one of these sessions just to see what it involves. Clicking into DNS records, you can see you're given a slideshow that you can easily flick between. So you can take your time if you're learning or you can go through it at a quicker pace. You can see we're looking at reverse IP lookups, DNS reports, IP location finders, and everything is explained detail by detail. Exactly what you'd need to know for OSINT purposes. So I highly recommend you also check this one out. The final free courses that we have for open source intelligence is Class Central. Again, if you've not heard of it, it's a list of online courses that's community driven. They basically aggregate courses from many providers to make it easy to find the best courses for any topic. For this topic, obviously, I've searched open source intelligence and then I filtered it by free courses on the left hand side. You can see by doing that, we've been given a total of 42 courses. Again, you can then filter by level or duration, depending on how much learning time you have. You can see that we're given a list of all the free courses and we have the information on the right hand side in terms of where this has been pulled from. So you can see many YouTubes, Udemy's and how long they are. All you need to do is either look at the reviews to determine whether you think it's a good learning resource or click into it and start learning straight away if you're already interested. There's lots of different ones on here. You can see some are focusing on open source at a very wide level and some are looking at specifically social media. Just clicking into one to give you an example, you can easily jump to the class or you can go through the information just to get a brief description on what you'll learn. 
So here we can see we have the concept of OSINT, deep and dark surface webs, open source intelligence versus closed source, aircraft documents and search engines. So it's a lot covered in one course. That's really good and I would highly recommend. Hopefully that's been useful for you if you're looking into open source intelligence and if you're interested in cybersecurity or just OSINT in general, do join our Discord. We have lots of information on there and there's lots of other members. We have over a thousand members now that are interested in similar things in cybersecurity. If you enjoyed the video, do leave a like down below. It massively helps it out and tells me that you're enjoying this type of content and I'll keep providing you with great resources in cybersecurity.